Hello, my name is Christian Water from TradeVola and like every week we also want to present you some um, interesting stocks this week. There are not so many like we had in the last weeks, especially with all these um, extreme movements uh, from some stocks, what we discussed in our previous videos here. So, but when you don't want to miss any of these videos in the next uh, um, weeks, then please subscribe to our channel. The first one, what I want to present you here is uh, Carnival Corporation, CCL with the symbol. We can have a look first on the chart on the right hand side. Um, most important here, we had like increasement in our um, option volume. It's not so high like we saw it in the last weeks, but also what is interesting here from the chart, we had a breakout on Friday. Um, what continues yesterday and um, today and you always have to see it in combination with the um, whole um, S&P 500 or with the whole situation in the market and then at this moment um, it's interesting to find stocks what are not really correlated to the whole market uh, which are positive even when the market um, drops for one or two percent and CCL is uh, one of these stocks I mean in this industry or in this um, um, yeah, part we see on many other companies um, like Norwegian Cruise Line or also like uh, airlines are coming now a little bit like American Airline um, and um, these stocks are performing quite well at the moment. Another one what was um, a signal or an interesting um, stock from yesterday is um, Exxon Mobil. Here we saw quite um, a few big Rates. First of all, the biggest volume was on the 8th of February. This was at the end, the beginning of uh, the breakout, I would say. But also yesterday we had um, quite a high option volume, and here it's pretty much the same. Um, there are quite a few bets that Exxon Mobile will move above the $55 um, in the next few weeks. Um, of course, we don't expect anything what is similar to the wheat stocks, what we discussed, or to GameStop or anything else. But um, like I said before, it's interesting to find some stocks um, which are moving um, in a positive direction when the market is not going that well. And um, even if the market is going down more, these stocks might be also having the same trend then. Um, but as soon as the market recovers, these stocks might be the first ones uh, who outperform the market in the same way like they do it now. Um, and yeah, Exxon Mobile is one of these, um, quite interesting. The other one is also a very big um, company, what everyone knows. This is Disney. In Disney, we had several news here. Disney is the, at the moment um, on his all time high. We can also have a look here on a weekly um, chart where every candle is um, one whole week and here you can see it um, it's at the moment almost at $200 and uh, there are a lot of bets that uh, Disney will reach the $200 or will break out uh, above the $200 this week. Um, news here was a new streaming um, um, streaming company or the new streaming offer from Disney what um, yeah, made the stock yesterday with this um, breakout above the last um, all-time high you can also see it here it was not exactly a new all-time high yesterday but today um, you can see it's going um, more against the 200 um, dollar level and then an old stock what we discussed in our previous videos as well is um, amc i think you still um, no, maybe some of these stories, um, if we see what happened here, this was something what we discussed um, uh, several weeks ago. But this is one of the um, only um, companies or stocks where we can see now another um, yeah, breakout, I would say. Next level will be $8 here and here the option volume is still um, super high. Of course, it's very risky because um, all these stocks are still considered as a um, high volatile investment so you have to make sure that um, there's a high margin impact um, for your portfolio if you trade on the margin account um, and what we will see here is also the implied volatility you can always um, see this here uh, in the option data is 200 percent 
So this um, should be a symbol for everyone or a um, signal that um, there's a high volatility and there's a high risk. Um, so that's what I always say, the information, what you can get from the option data should be also interesting for everyone who's just trading in stocks because it can give you some more um, detailed information and also what is interesting to see what are the bets from the market, where's the next level, uh, what might be the next breakout and um, for Disney we had it earlier, it's the $200 um, level, here it's uh, the $8 um, what should be reached maybe this week and um, on the other hand side for Carnival Corporation, what we saw earlier, I think it was um, $20, $25 and for Exxon Mobile, we saw quite a lot of bets for $55 in the next few weeks, even the um, stock is almost reaching this level. So these are the most interesting stocks for this week, but I'm um, yeah, quite sure for the next week we might have some good opportunities to buy some stocks, some options maybe on a cheaper level, because this is exactly what happens at the moment, uh, that um, there's just a technical correction so far. We don't have any news um, what might cause um, 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 yeah, a bigger down movement, but um, it's also important for every new investor, if you buy something, on maybe the highest point, then of course you might have the pressure to sell this and that's um, what a technical cor um, correction always implement that um, everyone who is not having maybe a, a big portfolio or because of fear he wants to sell it, all these investors will be pushed out by the technical correction and then the big players normally um, use these prices to invest uh, on a cheaper level. So far this is I think what we see um, the last two three days at the market, but um, still interesting. We will keep you updated with um, all interesting stocks also the next week. So please, please subscribe here to our channel to not miss any of the upcoming videos.